So last weekend saw Ney and I on a business trip which gave us the perfect opportunity to test out the Alienware X14, a 14 inch gaming laptop that can do basically everything. We just made it to the hotel. Nate's just currently editing some footage from earlier on the laptop. We don't have a whole lot else to do like this evening. So we're probably gonna play some games. He did bring an HDMI cable to hook up to the TV and I brought my guitar as well. Now in the past, it was go big or go home. We used to be the kind of people that would lug 17 inch gaming laptops around with us. But after so many trips, it gets pretty tiresome, especially with power bricks like this. So one thing I really like about this laptop compared to any other laptop I've owned before is the power bank. So previous in the video, we showed you what the power bank to my Alienware M17. Was it the M17 I owned? Yeah. Yes. So the brick for that was really big and you saw in the video. And what I like about this laptop is if you forget your charger and you bring it your phone charger, which pretty much everyone takes with them everywhere, you're guaranteed to be able to charge your laptop if it dies. So to me, that is like an absolute plus. Wouldn't you agree? I think Josh and I are gonna do a little bit of gaming because we've been working all day and we really wanna relax. So let's go do that. All right, mister, it's time to do- Is it gaming time? Some gaming. Sweet. What game are we gonna play? I downloaded like lots of games cause I, I couldn't decide which one to play. So yeah, we brought an HDMI cable with us. Uh, there was actually an HDMI port on the back of this laptop right here. Speaking of ports, they're all on the back, which Nay and I rather like since we're big on keeping everything looking clean in our setups. There's no ugly wires to stick out the side. It's a minimal yet functional selection, although I would advise picking up one of these for those times when you're turning it into more of a workstation. A few moments later. So we've got the HDMI cable hooked up to the TV. Obviously you can just game on this as is. For those of you wondering, it's specced with an i7 12th gen and an RTX 3060, which I feel like is a good pairing with the screen because it's got a full HD 144Hz display on it. So you're gonna be able to play everything, like even AAA titles at 60 FPS and have no problems. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna get this plugged in, play some games. Now a 3060 to some people might not sound like a lot, but when you consider how thin this laptop is at just 0.57 inches, it all starts to make sense. This is a do everything you need kind of laptop, but with emphasis placed on it being thin and small enough so that you won't think twice about throwing it in your backpack. After dying multiple times in Shadow of the Tomb Raider, no. oh my God. <laughs> it was time to play some guitar. Although unlike the X14, it's unfortunately not something that fits in my backpack. Now you might be wondering why I've brought a guitar to a hotel. It, it might seem a bit weird to those of you that don't play guitar. Basically, I've played since I was like 10. It was actually my main job before YouTube as well. Like I started YouTube on the side of teaching guitar. Yeah, I really like to just take it wherever I go. Um, what's good now is that you don't have to bring like heavy speakers and amps around with you because what you can do is just hook up your guitar with this cable to this little box which is called an audio interface that connects to your laptop via USB and then we've also got some monitoring headphones as well and basically there's software that you can install on your laptop that can get all sorts of like different sounds I can put my headphones on wherever I am and just jam out so yeah super cool it's actually crazy when you think about it we've gone from this like just a decade ago to this and that's everything you need one thing i never understand about hotels is they only give you one robe you know what this means guys babe rock paper scissors for the robe ready rock paper scissors shoot <laughs> yes! Now when it comes to battery life, the X14 is surprisingly good. I won't bore you with numbers here because it really does vary massively depending on what you're doing. As with all laptops with power hungry GPUs, gaming on it will drain it very quickly. I always like to wait till I'm somewhere I can plug in before I start doing any serious gaming. But for less intensive tasks like surfing the web, watching videos, and even light video editing, it should last you plenty long enough in most situations. This is partly thanks to NVIDIA Optimus technology, which basically allows the laptop to switch between the integrated and discrete GPU depending on the task. It probably won't get you through an entire day, but with such a small power brick and the ability to charge via USB-C, it's not something I ever worry about. I think Nay's passed out, although there's no way she's asleep because I'm way too loud. <laughs> we'll see you guys in the morning.
Good morning, guys. Good morning. Welcome back. Welcome back. How did you sleep? Pretty good. Pretty good. I feel like hotels always have the best beds. They do. I always sleep like a rock every time we go and stay at a hotel. But we are freaking starving, yeah, and they starving. have a really good diner apparently downstairs that's like a retro theme. So we're gonna go and get some. And they do breakfast, breakfast till two p.m. Yeah, two o'clock. That's what even is that? That's like past. What lunch. is it like in the UK? Well, I would call it dinner in the UK because uh, yeah. lunch is dinner, and then you have tea. I still don't understand <laughs> that. You have tea. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. <laughs> As we headed down the elevator for a late breakfast, and after Nene and the very polite receptionist bundled over their matching outfits, we ended up stopping by the hotel coffee shop for our morning caffeine fix, where we replied to some emails, along with the very important task of checking out the breakfast menu. <laughs> oh, and also the Wi-Fi at this hotel was, like, really good. <laughs> If you guys are wondering why we're here drinking coffee, it's because we had to put in a reservation at the diner and it's like 30 minute wait, so we thought we'd get some coffee, chill out, check some emails, get back to some people while we wait to get our food. I think our table is ready. We headed over to the diner, sat down and placed our order, which then gave me the perfect opportunity to finish off editing a video we'd shot two days before. Also, these pancakes were really good, although I thought they were going to be small, so I ordered three. I regret it. So, breakfast done, work also done for the day. Yep. Let's head home. In conclusion then, the Alienware X14 is a laptop that you will take with you everywhere. They always say that the best camera is the one that you have on you, meaning your phone, and I kind of feel the same way about the X14. If a laptop's too big, bulky, or can't last more than a couple hours without being plugged into a massive power brick, I probably won't take it with me. Don't get me wrong, I love powerful laptops with big displays, and they have their place too. But I'd be lying if I said they didn't spend most of their time back at home or in the studio. This one though, this belongs in the backpack. Just send us another one though, because me and Nate always fight over it. Thanks.